Windows S mode puts your computer on complete lockdown. Once activated, S mode lets you enjoy the highest level of security Microsoft can offer. However, there are limitations. These limitations in themselves wouldn't bother you if you're not a power user or want your child to use technology safely. You will also like S mode if you are a business person who handles sensitive documents. However, if you're a power user or an adult who prefers the flexibility of making your own choices, you should get the complete picture before you get a computer in Windows 11 S mode. So let's explore what it is and if it's for you. What is Windows 11 S mode? Exactly, S mode is a feature that Microsoft created to give users a secure, smooth experience with the Windows operating system. In this mode, your computer only gets access to basic resources and drivers. More notably, S mode freezes all other apps that hog your RAM and processes that may task your C. Windows S mode will sound very familiar if you have used the Chromebook. Should you use your PC in S mode? It depends. Here are four reasons you may consider using a PC in Windows S mode. One, you want to ensure your child's safety. S mode restricts the applications that can run on the computer to Microsoft Store applications only. So, your child cannot download software from third-party sources. You may also want to get a standard PC for your child and put it in S mode if you don't want to buy a Chromebook for almost the same price. You may then take the computer out of S mode as their tech needs increase. But remember, deactivating S mode is quite easy, and your school-aged child may learn to bypass parental controls. 2. You handle sensitive documents. Windows S mode prevents users from installing third-party apps. This restriction means your chances of installing malware on your computer reduce significantly. So, if you're a business person who routinely handles documents containing company secrets, you may use your personal computer in S mode. 3. You want to do a digital detox. If you find yourself needing an escape from digital noise, but can't avoid your PC entirely, consider a PC in S mode that can help. Games on Microsoft Store aren't the most exciting, and many handy third-party apps aren't there either. So, you will be using only the apps necessary for your productivity. 4. You want the Chromebook experience. S mode gives you a similar experience to what a Chromebook gives. So, you can get a high-end PC and try S mode for several days or weeks. This way, you can decide if you want all that power or if the basics work for you. More importantly, you retain the option to leave anytime you want something you don't get in Chromebooks. 5. Your computer boots faster. If you have been using a Windows computer for a while, you'll now notice how booting takes longer as you install more apps. This lag is because some auto-run apps start working in the background once you turn on your computer. What are the drawbacks of using S mode? Your computer works the way Microsoft intended for it to work, safely and efficiently. One, you can only get apps from the Microsoft Store. As seen on this Microsoft Dev blog, users of Windows S can only run modern universal Windows platform, UWP. These are apps that Microsoft developers directly created or verified. Other types of apps delivered through third-party licenses to the Microsoft Store will be unavailable in S mode. 2. You can't use the command line or code editors. S mode is not for you if you are a developer, hacker, admin, or IT person managing a network of company computers. S mode prevents users from using the window terminal or PowerShell. 3. The Windows registry is off limits. Like the command line and code editors, the Windows registry is also off limits to users in S mode. The registry is a powerful database of configuration settings that lets power users customize windows to their taste beyond the regular settings. However, tinkering with the Windows registry can harm your PC, something the clamshell of S mode is designed to prevent. We are going to end this video right away. If you have any query or information to share, please leave a comment below. Thanks for watching.